They had lost their parents before Haiti's killer quake. Now even their orphanage has gone. 65 children died when Our Lady of Nativity collapsed around them. And it just came down. Um, and how, how old were the children that were lost, the 65 children that were lost? I have one month to eat. 78 survivors, many with horrific injuries, have spent the past five nights sleeping on the street. Christina has a broken leg after being trapped in the rubble for two days. Arjlene was rescued after five. Orphanage director Evelyn Jacques has to scrounge for food and medicine but has run out of the basics like nappies. The only things flourishing here are the flies. They cling to strangers you want to hold my hand? Like they cling to life. Many of these children were due to be adopted by Westerners, but the officials involved have been killed and their paperwork has been lost. So right now, their immediate future is in limbo. Still, Haiti's littlest victims sing out of hope that one day they will finally have a mum and dad. But the earthquake has made sure more orphans will replace them. And today we heard from Australian quake survivor Rachel Hoffman. She and her partner Joel crawled through rubble to escape from their destroyed apartment. We ran to our front door frame and just stood there and screamed and wrote it down. Our ceiling knocked us to the floor. They were among the lucky ones. The United Nations now says this is the world's worst humanitarian crisis in decades. Chris.